It's the most widely used pesticide in the world and Europe, to the anger of environmental campaigners. EU approval of controversial weed killer glyphosate was set to expire at the end of this year. With member states in deadlock over whether to extend its use, the decision fell to the EU's executive arm. It renewed the approval for a shorter period of one decade, with new conditions attached. These restrictions include a prohibition of pre-harvest use as a desiccant and the need for certain measures to protect non-target organisms. In 2015, the World Health Organization's Cancer Research Agency found that glyphosate was probably carcinogenic to humans. But others disagree, such as the US Environmental Protection Agency and the European Chemicals Agency. And the agro-industry sector says there are no viable alternatives. The Greens' political group of the EU Parliament called for the Commission to go back on its decision. We should not gamble with our biodiversity and public health like this. EU member states are responsible for authorising the use of products individually within their national markets. French President Emmanuel Macron had committed to ban glyphosate before 2021, but has since backpedalled.